jobs are modern day slavery. We are paid just enough to live and not more. You are punished if you ask for more. We are often verbally abused on the job, sometimes more than is reported, physically abused, raped, castrated. The government gets up to 50 of your paycheck and then 10, 20 of that goes to kill people on other parts of the planet, including our own children. We are deluded into thinking our job friends are our real friends. With our job friends, we talk about pens and cubicles. We stop having real friends. If there's a glass ceiling, okay, it doesn't matter if you are a woman or minority or a white man. The, the glass ceiling is that you aren't allowed to make more than your master, even if he's an idiot. From 7 a.m. to 7 p.m., you are either going to work, at work, or coming back from work. The times when you can be most creative are garbage compacted into your cubicle. You eat shit at work. And even worse, you have to shit next to your coworkers and masters. Unless, like I have, you make a map of all the secret bathrooms in your local urban blight. When you are paranoid at a job, you are probably correct. They are, in fact, talking about you and backstabbing you right now. You realize that all the dollars you spent on degrees to get you a job that will make you happy were uh, completely wasted. You were scammed, but you can't let the next generation know. So now you become part of perpetuating the scam. A trillion dollar marketing campaign forced you to buy a house you didn't really want, and now you will lose a house you never really owned if you don't bow down to the masters every day. The words, the American dream, were coined by Fannie Mae in a marketing campaign 40 years ago to sell mortgages to slaves. Your spouse is tired of hearing about your job after six months and you couldn't care less about hers. 10 years later, you wake up next to a total stranger. 40 years later, you die next to one. Your IRA was not intended to provide for your retirement. It was intended to take money from you every month so you remain chained to your cubicle. Inflation then takes nine you bore your A. You create more value than you earn? That spread minus executive salaries is called profit. This is not an EOSM, just a definition. When you were a kid, you liked to draw and read and run and laugh and play and imagine a magical world. You're never gonna do any of that again. Over time, everyone is getting fired and being replaced by younger, cheaper, more temporary versions of you. It was a scam and you didn't even care. 